News 5 watching out for you tonight. Rabies cases continue to climb. 45 rabid skunks have now been recorded in El Paso County, and public health officials warn that we're just coming into the peak season for rabies cases. News 5's Andy Cohen had a rabid skunk uh, showed up in your neighborhood in the middle of Colorado Springs. Obviously, yep. first-hand look at uh, this can be a very uh, unhealthy situation. And that's the thing. These skunks have been found all over the county. Now, I live near Gary Berry Stadium, which is right in the heart of the city of Colorado Springs, close to Circle in the Constitution area. And one of my neighbors actually told me about the rabbit skunk. Here is a, na a number that you should call. You see it here on your screen, 1-877-642-2911. That's a number to the Colorado Public Health Department, and they keep that hotline staff seven days a week. If you didn't get a chance to write it down, don't worry. I'm going to repeat it again at the end of this report. A few days back, my neighbor spotted a skunk during the day. It was trying to dig through the pavers by his bushes. It wasn't acting aggressive, but he said it laid down and died not long after he spotted it. He called the Humane Society, but because the animal had died on what's technically city property, a pothole crew came the next day to pick it up. Public health officials say the best thing to do when you spot a skunk during the day is to keep your distance. We recommend that you keep, keep your children away from it, you stay away from it, keep your pets away. But who can you call for help? Well, if the animal is on your private property, then you can call an exterminator. If, like my neighbor, it's on city property, you can call them to pick it up. The health department also has a pest control business they contract with for emergencies. When we have a, a skunk or other mammal that could potentially be carrying rabies acting aggressively towards humans, towards children, so like in front of a school, a, a daycare center, something like that. City workers have collected 86 dead skunks this year. They picked up around 200 of them last year. Now, because there are so many rabid animals in the community right now, it's imperative to get your pets vaccinated. You know, it's so important and we really try and stress it all the time, but with all these cases of rabies that we're seeing in El Paso County, this is a wonderful time to remind everyone just how important vaccinations are for your pet. She says that's true even for animals that stay indoors most of the time. All right, again, for that state health department hotline number, 877-462-2911. It was correct on the screen. I just misspoke when I said it earlier. So 462-2911. The Humane Society tells us they're booked full for the next three weeks on those vaccination appointments. So they're encouraging people to try and schedule with them online. We've put a link for you as well as the phone number right now at KOAA.com.